what? 1-800-449-8255. It's the shark a ding dong the one and only, the master of disaster. Yours truly, your humble servant from the solid gold uh, shark a doodle do E I B golden sharker phone. It's not a microphone, you guys. This guy looks like he speaks into that. That's just a microphone. That's not a solid gold sharker phone. <laughs> Dallas Mayor leaves Democratic Party, switches to GOP. American cities need Republicans. <laughs> well, didn't they elect you as a Democrat? Dallas mayor leaves Democratic Party. I mean, I think it's good news. Don't get me wrong, but I don't like that. You know, he ran as a Democrat. You know, then maybe he should be a Democrat and just be like, I'm a Democrat, but I'm like a conservative Democrat for Trump. You know, instead, he just leaves the whole Democrat Party and becomes a Republican right here on the Clark the Shark Show at 1-800-449-8255. I don't know if I agree with that, you guys. I mean, I think it's cool. I love it when Democrats lose, but not like that. I mean, I think that's chicken shit. You know, it's kind of cheesy. Dallas mayor leaves Democratic Party, switches to GOP. <laughs> What a burn on the Democrats, man. That's classic. Look at this guy. I mean, he looks like he could go either way. Like, you know, dude, if I was a Democrat, I would stay a Democrat. You know, I'd just be like, I'm a, you know, I'm Clark the Shark, D, uh, California, you know, but I'm like a Trump Democrat. You know, we remember Reagan Democrats, you guys? I'd be like, well, I'm Clark the Shark. I'm a Trump Democrat. <laughs> I wouldn't switch to GOP. Although, hey, man, don't get me wrong, you guys. I love to see Democrats lose. I love to see liberals, uh, you know, just take a kick to the gut, like to the ribs. And this is definitely that. Dallas mayor leaves Democratic Party. This guy. <laughs> I mean, I, you know, you guys, me, Clark the Shark, I, I love to see anything bad happen to Democrats, but I don't like this stuff. I, I don't like it when someone gets elected by voters and then they like switch parties. That's, that's a low blow, man. To me, Clark the Shark, that's chicken shit. That's Bush League. I don't like it right here on the Clark the Shark show. But in this case, I'm kind of laughing. I'm like, cool. I'm like, this guy. I'm like, this guy left the Democrats. <laughs> and he joined the GOP. I mean, I got to admit, you guys, I'm tickled pink. Right here on the Clark the Shark show. FBI investigating Clark the Shark. Alleged abuse committed by Shark in Baton Rouge police warehouse known as the Brave Cave. FBI is mad as shark again, you guys, right here at 1-800-449-8255. I don't even know what this is. Look at this headline. Um, alleged abuse. Once again, we have the word alleged. Hey, liberals, anytime it's alleged or unknown anonymous sources or, you know, sources say, dude, get rid of the whole story. FBI investigating alleged abuse in Baton Rouge police warehouse known as the uh, what Bravo Cave or Brave Cave or, you know, dude, alleged. Once I hear alleged, it's like Bravo Brave or, you know, who gives a shit at that point? I hate alleged stories here, anonymous sources, stories of any kind. And I notice that the liberal Democrats, they get their best shit from anonymous, uh, no name, like nondescript uh, sources, you guys. I mean, I, I fucking hate it, you guys. Right here on the Clark the Shark Show, 1-800-449-8255. I like to see known sources with names. You know, like Adam Schiff. You know, Adam Schiff, at least, is like, we know who he is. 
he's a lying scumbag, but like, at least he's like there, you know, in person, like he's known. It's not like he's unknown at 1-800-449-8255, the Clark, the shark show, groundbreaking transplant of pig heart into Adam Schiff because he is a fucking pig at 1-800-449-8255. I'm just kidding, you guys. Clark the Shark Show. Let me read it again. Groundbreaking transplant of pig heart into living recipient is performed for the second time ever on Adam Schiff or uh, Pelosi because they're fucking pigs and the DNA and that pig heart works with them. Right here on the Clark the Shark Show, 1-800-449-8255, and God's like, that's right, Sharky, you got it, man. Adam Schiff could, like, you give him a pig heart or a jackal heart or, like, Satan's heart or Pelosi, and it's going to work just fine, Sharky, because, like, it'll match up with the right blood type, like, O positive or B positive or dude you know anything pig related you could put a pig brain into adam schiff or pelosi and, and it would fucking work at 1-800-449-8255 right here on the clark the shark show where i'm just getting warmed up on a friday at 4 57 p.m it's friday you guys thank god it's friday for sharky because i'm gonna I'm going to eat potatoes tonight. Like my wife, Bia, might cook potatoes uh, and meatloaf. This show brought to you by Meatloaf. Oh, you guys, Meatloaf died of COVID. And he wouldn't get the shot, dude. And his ghost talked to some guy on YouTube. And he's like, all right, you guys got me. I didn't get the vaccine. And dude, I feel bad for Meatloaf. I'm afraid to eat that meatloaf tonight because it might have COVID vaccine or maybe steroids or like hormones or or who knows what's in that meatloaf right here on the Clark the Shark Show, 1-800-449-8255. Fulton County DA investigator accidentally shoots herself at courthouse because she was a Democrat and like she doesn't got good aim. Plus like maybe she felt guilty because she counts votes in Fulton County, or maybe she investigating Trump and like, God's like, here, let me hold that gun, uh, dumbass. Here, I got it. Here, you put your purse down at 1-800-449-8255. Anyway, uh, she accidentally shot herself at courthouse. Sounds to me like it was no accident. 1-800-449-8255, the Clark the Shark Show. That's what you get for messing with Trump there, Fulton County. Or, uh, you know, bringing in suitcases of votes at five in the morning and then trying to blame it on Trump. Like Trump's like, well, well, well what's his suitcases here? Like at five in the morning and they're like, uh, don't you see they're the real votes, uh, Tr- Donald? You're a conspiracy theorist. Uh, you're like... You're a, a January 6th like maniac, like like you're one of them rat wing maniacs like Clark the Shark, like conspiracy guy, like, you know, you're an alarmist, Trump. So we're going to investigate you. But whoops, looks like our lead prosecutor investigator is uh, indisposed at the moment, Sharky, because she accidentally shot herself at the courthouse. Uh, Maybe they'll blame Trump for that. They'll be like, no, you know what? Alleged sources, we actually have an anonymous source that says Trump shot her. And that lady, Fanny or whatever her name, be like, yeah, Trump, I think Trump did shoot her. We have it on video. Actually, Democrats don't need any evidence or video or, you know, witnesses. They throw those all out of the courtroom now. And the liberal judge is like, yeah, you know what? I think Trump, it, it, it shouldn't say she accidentally shot herself. It should say Donald Trump, Rudy Giuliani, and Sidney Powell accidentally shot her. In fact, it wasn't an accident. It was like, it was on purpose. It was Donald Trump, you guys, in Fulton County, D.A., investigator this headline is all wrong it's it should read fulton county da investigator gets killed by donald trump and it was a conspiracy cooked up by rudy giuliani and Sidney powell and clark the shark at 1-800-449-8255 i swear to god you guys i know i know it's true it was 
it was actually Clark the Shark that that did it all because like he looks guilty, you guys. Like, I don't got any evidence. This guy's like, well, I switched. She's like, Sharky, don't blame me. I left the Democrat Party and became a Republican. And I'm like, good move, man. I'm with you, bro. He's like, hell yeah, Sharky. American cities need uh, – they need Republicans, Sharky. At 1-800-449-8255, I'm like, well, why do you think they need Republicans, bro? And he's like, well – I don't know, Sharky, like maybe they'll like, I don't know, deport like all the people here from Argentina, Colombia and like Ukraine and Poland. And I don't know, Sharky, we maybe we need you to be the governor at 1-800-449-8255. And I'm like, I'm with you, bro. Problem is, is I might switch from GOP over to Democrat and I'll just be like a Trump Democrat at 1-800-449-8255. You remember those Reagan Democrats? I'm going to be a Trump Democrat. This guy's like, well, Sharky, I used to be a Democrat, so I'm with you. I'm just now a Democrat for Trump. How's that? I'm like, yeah, man, like you can be, you know, you don't have to leave the GOP, Dallas mayor. You know, he's like, I'm going to leave Sharky and I'm going to become a Trump Republican. I'm like, you can be a Trump Democrat. Just man up to all your other Democrats around you. And he's like, no, you can't do that, Sharky. Once you're out, you're out. You know how it goes, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255. I'm the Dallas mayor, and I'm going to leave, Sharky. I'm going to leave and become a GOP. And I'm like... Well, you know, you might just be like a Liz Cheney GOP or maybe you'd be like a Mitt Romney GOP. I mean, what good will that do? And he'll be like, no, I'm going to be like a Trump GOP. I'm like, well, like if you do that, they'll just ban you on Twitter or ban you on YouTube or like ban you on uh, Facebook. And he's like, I don't care, Sharky. I'm going to be a Trump GOP. I used to be a Democrat, but now – I left the party, Sharky. (laughs) I'm like, good luck, dude. Dallas mayor leaves Democratic Party, switches to GOP. American cities need Republicans. Dude, it's okay for you to say that. You know, you're a Democrat or you used to be a Democrat. But like if Clark the Shark says that, they'd be like, Clark the Shark's like a racist. He's like, How dare you say American cities need Republicans, Sharky? What do you know? I'm like, yeah. Like, the FBI is like, FBI investigating alleged abuse in Baton Rouge by Sharky. It was, it was Sharky, you guys. I swear to God. 1-800-449-8255. Don't miss the best deals to shop on Amazon, which is a scam company. Uh, Hey, have you guys ever heard of Amazon Associates? Don't join that affiliate. They'll like take all your money. Like you'll go on there and make them $45,000 and they'll be like, well, your account is terminated. Um, And you'll be like, what what, what I do? And they'll be like, well, you made us $50,000 on Amazon Associates. And Jeff Bezos says your account is terminated, Clark the Shark, at 1-800-449-8255 from the fabulous golden EIB Sharker phone. And I'm like, what did I do, Amazon? And they're like, well, you made us money. And that's capitalism and that's bad, Sharky. And I'm like, well, are you going to give me the money? And they're like, no. We're going to keep the money, Shark, and we're going to ban and delete your account at 1-800-449-8255. And I'm like, I just got banned and deleted by the Elon Musk Twitter today, two accounts. And they're like, that's what you get, Sharky, for being a Republican uh, in social media. And I'm like, I, I, I'm, I, wait a minute. I thought Elon Musk is kind of like a, like a Republican. And they're like, no, Sharky. He may be a Republican, but he banned you uh, for not being Republican enough. And I'm like, oh, I get it. Like I got it. It's sort of like Democrats, like a liberal 
if a liberal's like not pro-choice, but still a liberal, that's not liberal enough. And then like Ellen or Taylor Swift will ban you. And then like Pink will be like, I'll never talk to you again. In fact, you're persona non grata now because you're you're calling yourself a Democrat liberal, but you're not pro-choice at one 800 449 and, and Elon Musk is like, oh, sorry, Sharky. I thought you were a liberal. I'm going to bring your account back. And I'm like, Elon, don't ban liberals or Republicans. Let us all speak. I mean, don't be like Amazon Associates. And Elon's like, oh, you're right, Shock. I bring, you know what, mate? I, I bloody bring you. I don't even know how to talk like Elon. He's more sophisticated. He's like, Shocky, I'll bring your account back since you're a Republican. And I'm like, dude, me, uh, I don't even know if I am a Republican, dude. But what I'm saying is don't ban people on Twitter, Elon Musk or X or whatever it's called, whether they are a Republican or a Democrat. All social media needs to quit banning people. I think that's the point. Like Elon Musk is now banning liberals from X. And in doing that, he accidentally bans some Republicans like Clark the Shark. See, that's the bad thing about banning because it is the slippery slope to banning everyone right here at 1-800-449-8255, the Clark the Shark show. And people are like, no, Shark game. Republicans are bad. They need to be banned, especially you, Sharky. And I'm like, well, maybe, I don't know, maybe you're right. 1-800-449-8255, the Clark the Shark Show. Meet the American who snapped the first selfie, Robert Cornelius, Philadelphia. Dude, the first selfie, dude. I used to take selfies back in the 80s, like 70s when I was 11. And people are like, no, Sharky, you don't matter. You're like, you don't exist anyway. And even if you did, you did not take the first selfie, Sharky. I'm like, dude, back in 1975 when I was 10, I used to hold a camera right up to my face and take a picture of my uh, myself. And I, you, that, I would call that a selfie at 1-800-449-8255. And they're like, no, Sharky. That's not an official selfie. You have to be a liberal like on TikTok or Facebook or like Twitter or YouTube for it to be a real selfie. You have to be an official or maybe not even liberal, just a real person who matters. You don't matter, Clark the Shark, at 1-800-449-8255. And I'm like... Yeah, you might be right. You know, I'm just going to roll and take the high road. And, you know, you're right, dude. I don't matter. 1 800 4490 of Clark the Shark Show. But this guy matters. Robert Cornelius. He took the world's first ever selfie, you guys. I swear to God. Yeah, none of us took selfies back in the 60s or 50s or 40s. Like Frank Sinatra probably took a selfie and they're like, well, that would have counted as a selfie, Sharky, because he's a somebody at 1-800-449-8255. But we're not sure about that, Sharky. Uh, We got to see some evidence. And I'm like, it's weird how liberals need evidence or proof when it comes to liberals or when they want it. But like for everyone else, you don't need any of that. You just throw out the witnesses out of the courtroom or you throw out all the evidence. And then like the liberal judge is like, well, you look like a Trump voter. So like you're guilty, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255 on the fabulous golden EIB Sharkerphone. It's not a microphone. It's a Sharkerphone, you guys. Solid gold. And it's not broadcasting. It's fabulous EIB shark casting, baby. And after two decades of glory, Patriots fans may need to accept a new era of mediocrity. Well, like me, Clark the Shark, I I just learned to roll with mediocrity right here on the Clark the Shark show. And everyone's like, yes, Sharky. And you deserve it too. In fact, who's Sharky? We don't even know who he is. He, He doesn't exist. They're like, oh, there's Sharky right there. Well, anyway, you deserve it, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255. When they finally do see me on the radar, they're like either laughing or they're like, oh, you deserve the mediocrity, Sharky. 
I mean, you were born for it after two decades of glory. Sharky fans may need to accept a new era of mediocrity, baby, at 1-800-449-8255. Like, hey, you Patriots fans, it's true, because, like, who's that quarterback, the guy married to Giselle or – Caitlyn Jenner, the, the lady that looks like Caitlyn Jenner, you know, yeah, you, that guy's retiring. 1-800-449-8255 looks like you guys need to accept mediocrity like yours truly, Sharkadoodle do. 1-800-449-8255 right here on the Clark the Shark Show. Two 21 easy lunch recipes. Oh, dude, come on. Easy lunch. You just take turkey that you buy at Stater Brothers and wheat bread and mustard and a Dr. Pepper. And you got a Sharky lunch at 1-800-449-8255 right here on the Sharky Show. Fed officials warn rates may rise again and stay higher for longer. That's because they're Biden Fed officials. And they're like, by the way, your rent might stay higher. Plus, like all these people come in here, they might stay here and make the rent even higher at 1-800-449-8255. And you know all the homeless, Sharky? Well, they're going to go higher at 1-800-449-8255 because Joe Biden don't know what he's doing. Or maybe he do. Maybe he's trying to wreck the country on purpose, Sharky. You ever think of that? 1-800-449-8255. Yeah, I thought of that one a time or two right here. Here on the Shark A Doodle Do Show, 1 800 449 Fed officials warn rates may rise, you guys. That means your fucking mortgage is uh, 2000 now. Well, it's going to be 3000 you guys. Your rent is 4000 now. Well, it's going to be 6000 But that's okay. Joe Biden's like, the economy is good. And CNN and the media and even Fox are like, yeah, everything's good. Uh, you know, they can't even lie about Biden's polls. Biden's polls are like 18 percent approval. I don't even think this guy will, will really win, even with mail-in votes against Trump. You guys, this guy is hopeless, dude. He's going to lose, or it just looks that way. I mean, I don't think he will. You know, with all the mail-in votes and the, you know, the scam electronic votes. I think Biden's going to win anyway. As a matter of fact, he'll win a third term and a fourth term. He's going to be like Roosevelt. They'll never get rid of Biden at 1-800-449-8255 on the Clark the Shark Show. Fed officials warn of rates may rise again and stay higher for longer. Yeah, that's great, Biden. What we need is high interest rates. Um, dude, Fed officials warn rates may rise again. Oh, that's fucking great, dude. Higher interest rates are great. It's just what the country needs right now, Joe, is uh, more credit cards with a fucking 40% rate on them. Joe's like, well, Sharky, that thing, you know, that credit card thing that you're using to live in a motel, like, you know that thing, Sharky? I'm like, yeah, yeah, that thing, Joe. He like, well, that rate might be going up, Sharky, uh, on your credit card or your mortgage or your apartment or every fucking thing else at one 800 9255 A Sharky, even your DMV for your car might be going up too, Sharky, at one 800 9255 I'm like, great, Joe. You're a fucking great president. He's like, ain't it, ain't, ain't it great, Sharky? And God's like, ain't it great, Sharky? I put Joe there. Uh, therein, like the Bible says, like, uh, therein lies, therein, whatever. Yeah, oh, yeah, dude, Joe Biden. Oh, dude, he was meant to be like God. Oh, yeah, dude, that's great. Dude, our fucking world's then met, meant to get hit by a fucking meteor then. If Joe Biden's meant to be our president, like we're meant to get hit by like a fucking comet or some shit at 1-800-449-8255. They're like, no way, Sharky. You're thinking negative now. Joe's a good president. I'm like, no, he fucking sucks at 1-800-449-8255. And right here, after two decades, Patriots fans need to, dude, you guys, dude, just accept the fucking mediocrity, man. I've learned to roll with it. You Patriots fans can too. Right here on the Clark the Shark Show at 1-800-449-8255. And I hope you like those high interest rates uh, that Joe Biden is going to give you at the feds. You're going to love it. U.S. will send Ukraine 
at Atacams, long range missiles for the first time. Oh, that's smart. Joe Biden is going to send like fucking ICBMs to Ukraine. That's going to uh, make it peaceful there. You know, it seems like the Democrats are the war party, you guys. Like they're like, we never saw a war. You notice how Democrat people are always in the street protesting wars, but never when Democrats are president. It's pretty convenient, huh? They suddenly have amnesia. Like they're all out there when like Trump or, you know, or Bush or Reagan is bombing someone. But like, where's all the protesters when Clinton is president or like Jimmy Carter or, you know, like uh, Obama or Biden? Like, maybe there are some, dude. Our world's so fucked up now, there probably will be protesters out in the streets from both sides at 1 100 449 on the Clark the Shark show. Like, dude, you, no matter who is president, you guys, if we're in a stupid war, you should protest it, uh, Code Pink, you hypocrites. Don't wait for, you know, just because there's a Republican in the White House so you guys can then go out and protest because you look like uh, hypocrite fools. Like Biden has us sending missiles to Ukraine. Where's Code Pink? Why aren't they protesting? Why isn't it on the front page of AOL? Now, why are we talking about an easy lunch or Fed may hike rates. I mean, where is Code Pink right now, dude? Aren't you guys all pissed off at Biden for sending long range missiles to Ukraine? And they're like, no, Sharky, we, we like it. In fact, in fact, we like wars. Uh, all us hippies who are, we stay home when Biden's president and we don't protest because like we don't want to rock the boat and shake the tree, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255. Well, I guess you guys don't give a shit about war then. You only care about war when Reagan or, you know, Eisenhower or, you know, Nixon or, you know, George Bush is president. And they're like, no, we don't like war, Sharky. We were protesting Lyndon Johnson. I'm like, oh, give me a fucking break, dude. Anybody could have protested that. Even even Republicans were protesting that at 1-800-449-8255. And Code Pink's like, well, Sharky, we like, you know, we'll protest Biden. You know, one day we will. I mean, and we're going to wait, though, till he sends long-range missiles to Ukraine. I'm like, dude, well, Code Pink, here's your chance. It's on the front of AOL and NBC Universal. U.S. will send Ukraine long-range missiles. I, I can't even pronounce the Atacams or whatever the fuck. Long-range missiles for the first time. That could start World War III, liberals. I think every one of you better go out and loot and destroy the McDonald's and, and burn down the Starbucks and the Burger King over this? Or what are you waiting for a convenient uh, liberal cause? I think this is a cause right here, you guys. Long range missiles to Ukraine. It's the perfect fucking shit for you liberals to go out and protest. But I don't see you protesting the war or any, anything Biden does involving war. Like you guys are like, well, he... He's a better like president than Trump. Trump was being friends with Kim Jong Un, and that's bad. Okay, so liberals are like, we don't like Trump being friends with Putin and being friends with Kim, but it's okay for Biden to send long range missiles for the first time to Ukraine. Dude, you liberals are so fucking stupid. You don't even know what you're thinking or doing. You're completely clueless. Tiger Woods reveals the greatest shot of his career. Oh, dude, he's made a lot of great shots, but he's not a very good driver up in Palos Verdes. Nearly 400 primate skulls headed for U.S. seized in France. What? Dude, what does that even mean? CBS News. Primate skull seized in France? Dude, if you can't explain the headline more like in, in detail, I'm not going to click and fucking read it. I don't know what, dude, I don't know what the agenda is. I don't know any, I don't get this, dude. Nearly 400. It's so stupid. The yellow headlines, like the yellow journalism, like the, or just shitty, irresponsible disorganized, crappy journalism. Uh, it's probably all done on purpose. Did you know you can weed your yard without bending over? 
dude, I mean, all the songs I write and like poems and uh, articles and paragraphs and shit. And all they got is, did you know you can weed your yard? Like, dude, like they put weed in there. Like, did you know you can smoke weed and bend over, Garth? Did you know you like, dude, what the fuck? I mean, did you know you can weed your yard without bending over, dude? I mean, you can use a weed whipper, dude. You don't need to like really bend over with those. AOL's like, really, Shark? We, we fucking didn't know. Like, Garth, we didn't know, Sharky, how much money YouTubers make and can earn according to creators. Well, lately, not much, you guys. So YouTube's really cut down on what they pay people in recent years. And that means YouTube is paying themselves your money, by the way, too. How much money? Here's why it's gotten so much harder to get a loan in the U.S. Well, because they know you're going to take the loan and either pay a motel because you're homeless or a hotel because you're homeless or you're going to buy a tent because you're homeless because the rent is 5000 a month right here on the Clark the Shark Show, 1-800-449-9255. Here's why it's gotten so much harder to get a loan in the U.S. Because you live under a freeway overpass, Sharky. Who the fuck going to give you a loan right here on the Sharkadoodle-Doo Show, 1-800-449-9255 from the fabulous golden EIB Sharker phone, the Wolfman Jack on crack. That's right, Sharkadoodle-Doo, Clark the Shark. Did you know you can weed or you can put your weed in there, Sharky, without bending over? Like they, they got weed and like porn reference in one headline, like bending over weed, Sharky. Did you know like you can bend over and, and like hide your weed in your asshole? <laughs> Sharky, did you know you can weed your yard without bending over? Or maybe you can put your weed in there, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255 right here on the Sharkadoodle-Doo Show. Here's why it's gotten so hard to get a loan in the U.S. Because the rent in Joe Biden America is 8000 a month and everyone lives in a fucking tent down on Venice Beach or down in skid row and people are like no shark it you can make it it just get nine people together and live in an apartment and all of you can chip in and pay you know you can all contribute to the nine thousand a month at 1-800-449-8255 and joe's like yeah sharky you guys can all contribute to that thing like that high rent thing at 1-800-449-8255 all the heart healthy foods and nutrients every woman should add to her diet Dude, how about add low rent to our diet, Joe? Make the rent eight fifty a month like it used to be in 2014. And Joe's like, no, Sharky, you can handle that high rent thing. Like you can pay your taxes, you can pay your car insurance and all your credit cards and your life insurance and your storage unit and the high rent, Sharky, at 1-800-449-8255. Come on, Sharky, don't be a loser. Don't be a quitter. You can pay 5000 a month to to live in a studio or like a one bedroom where the toilet is like right right next to the bed. Like you don't even have a bathroom, Shark. It's just a studio. It's just a kitchenette at one 800 449 Shark. You're 6000 a month. Quit being a loser, Sharky. You got to get out there and hustle. And you too, Sharky, can live in a kitchenette in Joe Biden America where the gasoline's eight bucks a gallon and Joe is polling at like 16% approval, Sharky. Come on, Sharky. It's your fault. You did it. Uh, don't blame Joe. Alabama seeks to execute prisoner using nitrogen gas. Asphyxiation, dude. Nitrogen gas. That's like what UFOs, like another planet's breathe. The aliens, you know, Sharky, at one 800 That's right. When they get here, the UFOs die. Like they get off their UFO. Remember, they, they breathe oxygen. Like they just flew all the way here, like 10,000 light years. But they didn't know you can't get out of the UFO. They set foot down on the ground and then they die at one 800 Because on their planet, they breathe nitrogen, not oxygen. 
and like they didn't know that. Now, you know what? I think the other UFOs are sending those UFOs as like guinea pigs. You know, those are like like the pawns. You know, that like lay down. You know, they're like the experimental like trial and error, like the magic mushroom UFO guys. They eat. They're like you guys go up and eat those mushrooms first and like try those out on earth and then get back to us, see what happened at 1-800-449-8255. Like one UFO is like, dude, I was tripping. Everything was purple. And then the other UFO, there's just an obituary in the LA Times. And then the one UFO came back and he's like, these are good mushrooms. Like we can make beef Wellington at 1-800-449-8255 right here on the Clark, the shark, the shark a doodle do from the golden EIB sharkerphone. All the heart health of foods you can eat. Alabama gonna execute a prisoner. The university ranked 814th globally, told to drop world leading from advertisements. Well, I'm world leading, you guys. Clark the Sharks ranked number one in the world. My show is the number one syndicated talk show host. Uh, you know, show in America. Number one, baby, me, shark a doodle do. Forget Rogan and Howard Stern and Hannity and Hush Bimbo and, and Tucker Carlson and, and Jim Rome and Kevin and Bean. Forget them all, baby. Forget, uh, you know, Joe Benson at KLOS too. It don't matter, baby. Jed the Fish, Freddie Snakeskin. Forget them all. Clark the Shark is number one. Escaped Missouri inmate captured in Pennsylvania. Not too far from where uh, the one guy, was, remember that one guy was, can't, I can't even pronounce, Danilo Cavante. Carlito Bragante was caught, Sharky. You know, the one guy, and they're like, well, like, it sure seems like a lot of prison guys are escaping lately right here on the Clark the Shark Show. Looks like the liberals are running our prisons, too. They're either letting people out or accidentally letting them out at 1-800-449-8255. Ain't it true, shark doodle doo 1-800-449-8255. Escaped Missouri prisoner. It's just a mosquito bite, Sharky. Or could it be Skeeter syndrome? Or could it be malaria or dang fever or COVID or HIV or hep C? I don't know, Sharky. I just don't get no mosquitoes on you. You got to use off by raid or whatever black flag spray a little off and get them mosquitoes off you this portion of the show brought to you by johnson and johnson wax or whatever they're called don't let mosquitoes get to you they spray a little raid all over you right here on the shark a doodle do show 1-800-449-8255 and keep those mosquitoes away by drinking coca-cola once again another sponsor mcdonald's bringing to you the fabulous number one ranked number one rated show in america clark the shark the shark a doodle do the golden eib sharkophone where you should be cleaning your washing machine you better do that all kinds of stuff gets in there which candidates will be on stage for the second republican debate well i know trump won't be there and he don't even need to be there because like he's ahead of everyone by like 50 or 60 points right here on the sharky show and like single in retirement 20 ways to live a fulfilling life on your own yeah man just be all alone and sad and like you know dude you'll make it i swear single in retirement just like you know you can pray to the lord like every day say prayers to the lord and lord will be like i will bring you happiness you just pray to me and like you know a lot of people do it you know i, I don't know how they do it but they do do it at 1-800-449-8255 on the shark a doodle do show which candidates will be on stage against trump well none because trump ain't going to be there so it's not even a debate single in retirement sharky i mean man that would suck single and retired report 100k worth of equipment stolen from bears at soldier field hmm i just leave that one right where it is. Bijou Phillips ditches wedding ring after split from Danny Masterson, who allegedly raped people. Uh, you know, no video, no evidence, just, uh, 
you know, testimony. For sure, dude, he's guilty, though. I know he is. Me, Clark the Shark, I swear to God, I saw him do it. I got no evidence, but, like, I got no proof. And him and Russell Brand both did it. In fact, they both did me, Clark the Shark, at 1-800-449-8255. I swear to God, I got no evidence. I got no proof. But the liberal judge would be like, don't worry about that, Sharky. You don't need no proof. You don't need no evidence. Nothing. No no witnesses. We're good, Sharky. We're going to convict that Trump voter. Uh, or even if he isn't a Trump voter, it might be just be a liberal, but we'll still convict him because he must be guilty. He's a male. He's like a straight male or like, you know, he might vote Trump. So who knows? We think there's a chance he might be a Republican or right wing or, or even if he isn't, Sharky, we don't care anymore. You know, with the slippery slope, we just ban and delete people and we put them in jail with no evidence, no nothing, Sharky. 1-800-449-8255 and true crime writer helped tender murderer in prison, shame. Uh, dude, what? True crime writer helped tender murderer in prison shame report. Crime writer helped tender. Uh, dude, why would you help a tender murderer? Like, I don't get that. Uh, once again, it's a shitty headline. I have no idea what the fuck it means. Andrew Luck enjoying retirement reports for the 249ers post game dressed as namesake civil war mimi oh dude sure like okay ncaa conference could be forced into major n i l change dude what i mean n i n what dude that couple of these headlines i don't know mark cuban reveals why he'd consider l leaving shark tank dude you better not leave shark a doodle do though at 1-800-449-8255 you can leave that shark tank mark cuban but don't you dare ever leave shark a lamb a ding dong yours truly clark the shark right here on shark radio from the golden eib sharkerphone don't you dare leave shark it don't you change that channel don't you touch that dial mark cuban you can leave that shark tank all you want but you you ain't leaving shark a lamb a ding dong shark a doodle do clark the shark right here from the golden eib sharkerphone it's gold plated sharkerphone it's not a microphone baby does the senate really need a dress code i think they do you know hell yeah who's bob menendez ng senator charge with corruption well you know he's a democrat because the headline just says senator it doesn't say Democrat. So who's Bob Menendez? And New Jersey senator charged with corruption has survived politically for years. Well, yeah, he's a Democrat in a corrupt blue state. Duh. You know, who? Do, who's going to fucking convict him? But now, like, what's going on with him, dude? Who's Bob Menendez? New Jersey senator charged with corruption. Who's charging Democrats in a blue state? That's weird. At 1-800-449-8255. But with the slippery slope, you know, even Mark Cuban might leave Shark Tank and, and even a Democrat might get arrested in the Democrat world where anyone, you know, they must not have any evidence on Bob Menendez or witnesses or lack anything, but they're still charging him with corruption at 